Hello creative, welcome. In this video we will learn how to make a logo. And the logo that we will make is a combination of horse and lightning. Let's get started. Open your Adobe Illustrator, create new, then change the size to 1350 pixels by 1080 pixels. Create the name of the document you want. In this video I named the document horse logo. And then click create. Go to file, place to insert the sketch result. Select an image then click place. Previously I had sketched it. Drag the image and increase the size of our sketch. Click the image then go to properties. In the opacity, decrease the opacity to 50%. Enlarge the sketch a little more. Then go to the object menu, and select lock, or press Ctrl plus 2 on the keyboard. We will make a logo with circles. Go to the square icon, then select the ellipse, while press Shift, drag mouse down to make a circle. Adjust the size of the circle with our sketch. Drag it into the anchor point below to form an ellipse so that the object is precise with our sketch. Duplicate the object or ellipse by pressing Alt then drag. Make another line, and adjust it, with the sketch. Duplicate the object, or ellipse again, by pressing Alt then drag. Zoom out a bit, then rotate, and adjust to our sketch. Duplicate the ellipse again, and adjust it, to the horse's arm. Make another line, and adjust it, with the sketch. Draw a line, with the line segment tool, to make the neck, and head of the horse. Click the small ellipse, and then duplicate it. Make it a little big. Drag it into the anchor point, making it a bit more elliptical.
make a small circle, by pressing the letter L for shortcut. Enlarge it a little, then fit the position, between the lines. Change view to outline, go to view, then select outline, or press Ctrl plus Y. Make the circle touch the line, and make sure no path is open. Duplicate the small circle, and do the same thing. block, and select all objects. Swap black stroke to black fill, or press shift plus x. Click the object to be merged. Great, we have combined all the parts. Go to Object. Then select Unlock All. Click our sketch, then press Delete to delete it. Separate our logo, with objects we don't need anymore. Next, we will choose the text that matches the logo. Go to the toolbar and select the type tool, or with the shortcut press the letter T. On the menu control will appear font choices. I use Montserrat font family. Then type the logo name. The position of the logo text, is up to you. I position it, under the logo only. Turn it down a bit, change the font thickness, to extra bold italic. Change the word power, to semi bold italic. Set the distance between the lines, I think 60 points is enough. Let's make another version, shrink logo and text, then put the text, to the right of the logo. Nice logo, and here's the final result. Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe, and see you to the next tutorial.